good morning students in this video session we are going to solve a question from exercise 15b the question number is 7 so i have written the question on the board you can see the length of the sides of some triangles are given below which of them are right angle so here i have taken two questions the sides of the triangle are given. Suppose if we take the first side as A, the A is equal to 15 cm, the second side as B, so that is 20 cm, and third side is equal to C, that is equal to 25 cm. In the same way, I have taken the second question also. Side A is equal to 9 cm, side B is equal to 12 cm and side C is equal to 60 centimeter. Now here we need to prove whether with this size whether that triangle is a right angle or not. So for solving this one first of all you need to find which is the largest side. So here when we take the question number one we can see that the largest side among the three sides is 25. So right here the first step you should write is the largest side is C that is equal to 25 centimeter. Now if we do the square of the largest side and we get the answer that is whatever the answer will come of the square of the largest side and we get the sum of the squares of the other two sides equal then we will say that triangle is a right triangle so here the largest side is c so if i get c square is equal to the sum of the other two sides the squares of the other two sides so means a square and b square so whatever we get if we get c square is equal to a square plus b square if both are equal then we will say it is a right angle triangle now c is how much to 25 square is equal to that is a is 15 square plus b is how much 20 square so 25 into 25 if you do, you will get 625 is equal to 15 into 15, you will get 225 plus 20 into 20, you will get 400. Now if I get 625 is equal to, here when we add, we get 625. So here you can see that C square is equal to A square plus B square. We have got the same answer that is 625 is equal to 625. So we will write that if is a right angle triangle by converse of Pythagoras Pythagoras theorem. So this we have proved that the first question that we call one is a right angle triangle. Okay. In the same way now we need to do the second one also. If we get the same answer, the same procedure we are going to follow. If we get the same, then we will again say that it is a right angle triangle. If we do not get the same, so we will say it is not a right angle triangle. So again, here side A is 9, B is 12, C is 16. So again you compare which side is the uh, largest. So we will write here the largest 
psi is again here it is c that is equal to 60 centimeter so again if we get what that is c square is equal to sum of the squares of the other two sides that is a square plus b square okay now here c is 60 so we will write here 60 square is equal to which one a a is 9 square plus b is 12 square so 16 into 16 how much we will get again I have doubt I can multiply 6 6 is 36 that is 6 6 over 6 plus 3 9 put across 6 1 so I got here 6 5 2 that is 256 so I can write here 256 is equal to what I will get 9 into 9 81 I will get plus 12 into 12 I will get 144 now this 256 is equal to if I add 1 plus 4 I will get 5 8 plus 4 2 1 carry 1 1 plus 1 2 so here if you see both are not same the left hand side it is 256 the right hand side it is how much 225 so both are not same or we can say that c square is not equal to a square plus b square so here we will write 256 is not equal to 225 or we can write here c square is not equal to a square plus b square i have put the equal to and i have cancelled that will be read as not equal to okay now because they are not equal so we will write the last step if so if is not a right angle triangle by converse of Pythagoras theorem. So we need to write this one. It is not a right angle triangle by Pythagoras theorem. So this is how we find whether the triangle is a right angle triangle or it is not a right angle triangle if the sides of the three sides of the triangle are given to us. So I hope you will try to understand this video and solve the other questions that are related to this type of questions. Thank you.